Yeah, what's up, Doc? I went to the Two Rivers Skate Park. That's in Glenwood Springs. You know what's wild is I used to park my truck right at the top of this hill, a thousand feet away from this park, but I was blocked. I was so close and I didn't even see it because this park is so small. Well, it may be small, but it sure is rough. A lot like Doc Holliday, you know he's buried in this town. You can get around pretty quick at this park. Doc Holliday got around. He was born in Georgia and he went to dentist school in Pennsylvania. Whenever he got out, he found that he had TB. His mom died of TB. That's probably where he got it. Back in the olden times, they thought that you could get rid of TB or at least mitigate its effects by living in a dry climate. Probably that's because people had their windows open. You know it can live in dust for like six or seven years? That's why they always give you a test for that stuff whenever you get into jail. But what Bat Masterson said, the reason why he came out west was probably because he got into trouble for shooting at a bunch of guys because they were black. Besides being super dumb, he was also pretty smart. He spoke French and Latin and a bunch of other languages, and he was a surgeon, so, I mean, that's worth something, right? You don't have to be a surgeon to get in this bowl. The thing's pretty forgiving. It's only, like, three foot tall, but I could swore the flat bottom of that thing is just packed dirt, not even concrete. Yeah, you know John Henry Holiday? He was a gambler. That was his main profession, and uh, he was probably a little bit of a cheat. So he started practicing with pistol and knife, and he ended up getting into some fights. Some people claim that he got into as many as 30 gunfights and he killed at least 16 men. Newspaper reports, death certificates, obituaries. There's only two men that they could verify. There's only at least eight gunfights that they could count on. One of those guys, he slashed him across the belly and spilled his guts everywhere. Well, the coolest stuff has a lot of flaws. Check out this park if you need a pause. See y'all later.